Good day, everyone. Our lesson is the visibility rules 4, 4, 8, 11, and 12. So, the visibility rule for 4, a number is divisible by 4 if the last two digits of a given number is divisible or multiple of 4. So, example, 44,080, 5,124, 104,692. So, let's identify the last two digits. Okay. Is it 80 divisible by 4? The answer is yes. 24 divisible by 4? Of course. 92 divisible by 4 o kanina sabi nyo 80 divisible by 4 so 90 minus 80 ang tira na lang ay 12 so yung 12 ba pwede pang paghatian ng 4 o pwede naman pala so 92 is divisible by 4 ok next a number is divisible by 4 if the last 2 digit of a given number is 0 so kanina multiple and divisible multiple or divisible ngayon naman 0, 0 na yung last 2 digit so yun lang ang titignan natin so ang example natin 44,000 5,100 and 104,600 so yung last 2 natin ay 0, 0 kaya divisible by 4 divisible by 4 a number is divisible by 4 if the last two digits of a given number is divisible or multiple of 4 and if it's 0. So, remember that. Next, divisibility rule for 8. A number is divisible by 8 if the last three digits of a given number is divisible or multiple of 8. Kanina, last 2 sa 4, ngayon naman sa 8 ay last 3. So, let's uh, see the example. 48,080, 6,224, 104,896. So, check natin sila. Okay, let's check. 0, 18. Hindi pwedeng basahin ganon. Kaya, 80. Yes, divisible by 8. Okay. 224. Divisible by 8. So, 224. So, yung 200 automatic na hati sa 8. So, yung 24 na hati din sa 8. Kaya, the answer is yes. 896. Alam naman natin yung 800 na hati. So, yung 18 na hati din. So, may natitira na lang tayong 16. Pwedeng-pwedeng hatiin. Kaya siya ay divisible by 8. Okay. Another. A number is divisible by 8 if the last 3 digit of a given number is 0. Kung kanina, dalawa lang ngayon. Kailangan tatlo. So, ang ating example, 48,000, 6,000, and 104,000. So, yung tatlong zero. From hundreds place to ones, dapat zero. So, it will be divisible by eight. A number is divisible by eight if the last three digits of a given number is divisible or multiple of eight and if it's zero. Divisibility rule for 11 a number is divisible by 11 if the difference of alternating sum of the given number is 0 and if it's multiple of 11. So, example. What are we going to do again? Alternating. So, what are we going to do? To group them. So, let's see. So, here we go. Yan. We will group them. So, lahat ng nasa bilog, yun magagrupo. Lahat na nasa rectangle, magagrupo. Alternating sum. So, it means we're going to add each group. So, 5 plus 0 plus 0 equals 5. 
8 plus 8 equals 16. So, sabi natin kanina, alternating sum and the difference. 5 from 16, wala naman sinabi kung yung nauna sa nahuli. Basta, we will find the difference between the two. So, we subtract smaller to bigger. 16 minus 5 equals 11. So, pasok. Kasi dapat multiple of 11 or 0 ang magiging difference. So therefore, 58,080 is divisible by 11. Another example. Let's group them again. Okay. So first group is 6 plus 2 plus 7. The answer is 15. 9 plus 6. The answer is also 15, so let's get the difference, and the difference is 0. So therefore, 69,267 is, yes, divisible by 11. Kasi yung sabi kanina, alternating sum of the given number, and if the difference is 0 or multiple of 11. Divisibility rule for 12. A number is divisible by 12 if the given number is divisible by 3 and 4. Uh, so, madali lang siya. Parang 6 lang yung rules niya, no? Sa 6, 2, and 3. Ngayon naman, 3 and 4. Sa example, 43,080, 5,124, 103,692. So, Check natin yung ating example. 43,080. So, unahin muna natin. Is it divisible by 4? Yes. So, find the sum of the digits. And it is 15. So, therefore, it is yes. So, 43,080 is divisible by 12. 5,124. So, check natin. 24 divisible by 4, of course. And then, 5 plus 1 plus 2 plus 4 equals 12. 12 is divisible by 3. Kaya, dahil dalawang yes natin, kaya yes din siya sa 12. Divisible by 12 din siya. 103 1,692 So, 92 Divisible by 4 ka ba? And yes So, add natin yung sum na yung add natin yung yung ating sample given Ang sagot is 21 So, yes din siya So, we have 2 yes Is it Divisible by 12. Okay, let's see. If the last three digit of a given number is divisible or multiple of 8 and if it's 0, identify nyo nga anong rule yan. Yan ay divisible by 8. Very good. If the last two digit of a given number is divisible or multiple of 4 and if it's 0, it is divisible by 4. Great job! If the given number is divisible by 3 and 4, is it divisible by 12? Very good! If the difference of alternating sum of the given number is 0 or and if it's multiple of 11, or what do you think? What operation? Or what divisibility rules is it? Is it divisible by? Yes, 11. Very good. So let's check if it's divisible by 4, 8, 11, and 12, the three given number. 27,080, 8,432, 5,148. So, check muna natin if it's divisible by 4. Last 2, 80, yes. 32, yes. 48, yes. 
how about 8 last 3 digit 280 yes 432 yes 148 no alternating natin kasi 11 so 2 plus 2 4 7 plus 8 15 15 minus 4 is 11 8 plus 3 11 4 plus 2 6 11 minus 6 equals 5 not divisible 5 plus 4 9 1 plus 8 9 9 minus 9 it's 0 so yes how about divisibility rules for 12 so we need to check if it's divisible by 3 so 2 plus 7 plus 2 plus 8 equals 19 not divisible by 3 so x kasi lahat sila divisible by 4 so check na lang natin kung divisible by 3 8 plus 4 12 plus 3 15 plus 2 17 not divisible by 3 therefore not divisible by 12 5 plus 1 6 plus 4 10 plus 8 18 so it is divisible by 3 therefore divisible by 12 very good so congratulations na pagtagumpayan mo ang pakikinig and I hope you understand and I believe naintindihan mo kasi napakadali lang naman niya so congratulations and thank you